back to the cove guys we're gonna do pokemon this time my son mason my name is scott uh, i am a full-time reseller and we do this stuff for fun so we actually have two boxes we're gonna do two separate videos these are the fusion strike elite trainer box these are the u.s ones they're not the japanese versions so if i get my hands on the japanese ones we'll do a video on this but they're kind of hard to find we're gonna open it up see what we get hopefully we get something decent because our last video that we did was absolutely terrible hopefully we get our money's worth out of this one player's guide fantabulous Never played Pokemon. Let's collect the cards. You don't want to play Pokemon. Yeah, when was the last time you played Pokemon? Um, as soon as I caught in an infinite loop, and it wasn't even that expensive of a deck. Jeez. Oh, Set up exactly like any other Elite Trainer box. You're gonna have your rules. The divider, obviously. Then they give you these. Actually, a pretty cool dice. Purple. And your markers. Your dividers always come in these elite trainer boxes. Energy packs. And then you get your game stop and then your sleeves. You know, the Mewtwo sleeves are kind of cool, actually. That is not Mewtwo. That's not Mew. That is Mew, but it's, Mew. Not, but it's so. not Mew too. Uh, and then they give you eight packs of Fusion Strike. We'll let Mason go first. And I'm going to have the uh, TCG player app so we can scan and see if we get anything worthwhile. So I ended up getting these for a little bit of a deal, I think. Um, I'm not sure what retail is on these to be honest with you. So they cost me $90 for both boxes. Hopefully we do better than the last $100 box that resulted in $25 per turn. It was terrible. Now you know the really basic work. you know the basic formula? Yeah, you take these packs, you turn them upside down, and you're supposed to do one, two, three, four. Oh no, all but the last two cards are pretty much worthless. <laughs> so he's going to run through them, and we're just going to show you guys what the decent ones are. No, 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 and no, no. All right, so we got a, I believe I call it a uh, shiny, I believe that's called. It is foil. So, Aurora. We're gonna... Listen, the last gen I played was Gen Five. Let's see what it's worth. Two full speed. It looks good. Let me try mine. While well, he's looking that one out. Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> I was garbage. <laughs> that was I'm gonna open the next pack. I'm not even gonna bother. Flip it through. So I got a snob, an onyx, jigglypuff, Dwamp, Panzer, Please. Come on. And I have a yeah. foil crumpet. <laughs> mm -hmm. So I will go through all the other cards to make sure. Oh, 12 cents. <laughs> the rares were 12 cents. That's terrible. So you can get this one. Here's the scan. Well, it doesn't help that you're not scanning the whole card. I am scanning the whole card. 7 cents. That's a common. Is it foil? It's foil. Four 
14 cents. Ooh! <laughs> it doubled in <laughs> value. That's terrible. I'm going to get mine open a while while we get on the slow poke. Okay. <laughs> you really are a Gen 1 boomer. That's right. <laughs> These are terrible. Is that your hit? For alligator. No, no this no. is my hit. That's your hit. Finally, something decent. So we're going to show you. You got two decent ones. I got for alligator. Nice foil. Oh, no, you're closer than that. Oh. That close enough? And then I got a Pokemon that I don't care about, but it's full art, so it's cool. <laughs> is it Greedent? Yeah, Greedent VMAX, I think. Oh, no, it's just regular V. Hit number 53. Oh. 252. So that is an ultra rare. It looks like it's going... There's only one listed. It's got it. Started bid at thirty-one dollars. That's on eBay. So there's one sold for that card, the Fusion Strike. This is actually the alternate art they call it, and it was listed for fifty dollars. Uh, best offer accepted, so it probably sold for like forty or forty-five, which ain't bad. Actually, that's not full art. I take back what I said. It's alternate art. That's what they say it is. So, that's a good hit for the first box. That pays for the box. So, I might want to separate that foil that's in there. Oh, yeah, word for So, there you go. crap, crap, crap. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. My god. I don't know if that's anything or not. So I got a sizzle pea foil. And the, aren't the fusion strike ones worth something? The fusion strike energy? Yeah. The ones that scan it. So we're still, I don't know a lot of these, these fusion strike cards. And I know when they have fusion strike on them, there's, I thought there was supposed to be something special about them. So that could be wrong. My guess is it's the same as like snow covered lands in magic mm, fair enough. like a gimmick but to be fair they'll bring that back it's worth nothing <laughs> <laughs> our, uh, our readers apparently aren't working very well go ahead and do your next pack i don't know why this won't scream Put it on a bright contrast here. It works best under white. Yeah, I know, but it's just like... Okay, let me show here. you how to use this. Gosh. You line up the card. I do line up the card. The whole card. I know how to do that. Mm. So I will go through and update if there's anything special. How's that? Yeah. I don't know why that's not working. Yeah. Anything good? Uh, you look like you have got trash. I mean, it's legendary. Oh, Latios. And... Yeah, you got the one of these weird Latios fusion. It, I don't know what to call that, but it's a Maywile. Not a foil card. I don't know if that's considered foil. Let's see if I get any good. I, oh, oh, oh! You may have beaten me. I did. I got a Brack. Wrap locked foil. I know this card is only worth like a dollar. Just so you know. 
already see that one. And then there's a Morgram single strike, which I don't know if it's worth taking on or not, but I know this one is. It's a uh, Intel Leon V Max full art, I'm pretty sure. That's a nice one. I think that's a real good hit. <laughs> Mason's going to try to scan it. I actually think I may know this card. I watched a streamer called Ray do uh, unboxings, and he just got freaked out when he pulled this card. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, we should be freaking out. Let us know. Like I said, we are still kind of um fusion strike stuff we just don't know we're gonna look this up because we believe this is gonna be worth looking up that is not worth what i thought it would be so it's the full art you would think that this card being a v-max it'd be worth more than this card which is 40. This guy is only fifteen dollars. Still not a bad hit. I'm not complaining, that's for sure. Definitely getting the value out of the box, but uh, I think the two big hits are out of the box already. What is this? At least it sells good. More Pico? <laughs> it it looks like a bootleg Pikachu. <laughs> I've never seen this before. It must be some sort of fusion thing. I think so it's there's gonna... a foil. Is there a reverse foil? Yeah, you got a foil and a reverse foil. So the I don't know how to say that. That is, that is Kangaskhan. You gotta get closer. He's not used to this. Hope you can see him. And then we have what looks like Electric Toxic Rook. <laughs> Who is it called? Toxtricity. Toxtricity. So I got the last one here. Let's see how we do. There's Toxel. That's probably the one you need for that. So I have a foil low punny. I think that's a legendary. Mm -hmm. I think. I think that's pretty much it for that. So. You didn't even show them the legendary. That well, I, one, I think is legendary. I'm not well, sure. They all say basic, and they're stage one. Meloletta. I, I think that's legendary. I don't think so, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't think that's a legendary. I have a buddy of mine that I can send a picture to, and he'll be like, yep, 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 nope, nope, nope. So, let me figure this out. So, a $45 box break is what it cost me. We got our money back, so that makes me happy. You guys get to see some cool cards. And, uh, Mason's looking it up. That was a Gen 5 Pokemon? Yeah. Not legendary. <laughs> Definitely not. I've never seen this Pokemon before. I, I will show you my playtime in Pokemon Black. It's like 600 hours. And I've never run across that thing. <laughs> so, I'm assuming the top two cards of the Fox are these guys right here. Very, very cool. And we thank you for joining us here at the Co. Come back for the second box break that we're going to do on the next video. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time.